What's up everybody? This bottle cap here from Exodus Prodigy. And today I thought I'd show you a little bit about my farming strategy. This is my base, Town Hall 9, almost maxed. Working on those Lego walls there. Uh, they're a beast, but I'm getting them one at a time. Every day helps. So I thought we'd take a look here at my attack log. Now you don't always find the loot, as you can tell. But when you do find the loot, you want to have a strategy that works, that gets you in there so you can maximize your potential. So this guy's got a farming base. I drop out some archers at the top. Just want to make sure I get that star. You know, you want to get the loot bonus. Even if you're down in gold three, that loot bonus always helps. I mean, if you don't win, then you're missing out on a little bit of gold. But see, I'm a barcher. And I always carry about 80 to 90 barbs and uh, my 120 archers. And uh, I always carry four wall breakers. And there you can see why. I, I distract the defenses with some barbs and I throw my wall breakers out just so I can penetrate inside there because I want to get to those storages where all the loot's at. I don't generally use spells, but here I threw down a rage because I wanted to try and get them without using a bunch of troops on that one section. So there I uh, start on the, no the other section there on the bottom, and I'm going to push into it also. There I throw down my wall breakers because the uh, defenses are distracted. Now this big bomb kind of hurts me right there, but, you know, you make do. I didn't want to use all my archers because I still wanted to try and get to that other compartment on the top. So I threw down everything, and I wanted to get my Archer Queen in there to try and finish that off. Um, I thought she'd make it to the DE storage. That's kind of why I wanted to throw it in, because I love that Dark Elixir. But unfortunately, I don't think she makes it. She dies out here because she sees the king and, like always, starts shooting a wall. Because that's what she's good at. But anyway... I see that I don't have many troops left, but I want to get that last bit of loot. So I threw down my king, threw out the rest of my archers, and uh, I should have used my jump spell here looking back so I could get the king over in there quicker, but I didn't. That's just something you got to live with. But I managed to break through the wall anyway, and I get those troops inside there. Um, again, I don't like to use spells that much, but... I really wanted these last two to make this a big raid for me, so I threw down that heal spell to try and keep my uh, archers healed from that whiz tower that's pounding them there on the right. And I ended up getting the last of this gold storage, and it comes up to be just over 800,000 worth of resources, plus a little bit of dark elixir. So that's my strategy. I always keep the wall breakers with my barch. Um, I don't always have my heroes because of upgrade time, but, you know, I try to maximize them when I do have them. Um, here we are from Exodus Prodigy. Just thought we'd give you a few tips, and uh, hope you enjoyed it. See you, everybody.